Welcome to Google Classroom. This is a demonstration of how to join Google Classroom for our Hayes Edgeforia eCourse for Google Apps. So the first thing you're going to do is go to classroom.google.com. Once there, you're going to have to log in with your Hayes Google account. Um, that should be exactly like your actual email for HayesCIC.net, except the only thing that's going to be different is you're going to add a G dot between the at symbol and HayesCIC.net. So it should be your normal email address, and then it'll say at G dot HayesCIC.net. Um, if you've never logged in before, your password should be Hayes Teacher. Um, if not, um, you can submit a request to have that reset if you can't get in um, to uh, Chris. Peterson, that's Chris with the K. So once you're in though, you're going to um, log in and click on this plus symbol. Make sure before, if you don't see this screen, um, you might see another screen that wants you to choose between student or teacher. Please, please, please make sure you choose teacher. Um, even as a teacher, you can still join classes, but as a student, you cannot create classes. So make sure you choose teacher. Once you've done that, click the plus sign here. And then you're going to have the option to create a class or join a class. In this case, for our Edge of Four Year course, you're going to join a class. So you're going to click Join Class. You're going to get this prompt box, and you're going to want to enter in the code for our class. In this case, it is F7CTH3N. Once I've typed all that in, the blue Join button pops up. I'll click Join. And as simple as that, we are into our course. So... Once you come here, this is kind of the landing page. You'll notice there's a stream, there's a, a tab for classmates, and there's an about tab. So the about tab has just information for you for this course, um, just kind of some links and things you can go to. Um, it has the digital learning page for ACISD, and it also has the Google Apps support page where a lot of this information actually came from. So this is just kind of a, a place for you to check um, if you need some help. The stream is where everything is going to take place. So in this case, if you look and scroll down the stream, you'll see all of the assignments, documents, spreadsheets, presentations, Google Docs, Sheets, Drive, Google Drive, and we could keep going on and on and on, but we're going to scroll back to the top. So we see our first assignment here is called Documents. So it tells us to please read over the document below, and then after reading, we're going to click on Documents up here, um, and then follow the template instructions to create a document. So First thing we're going to do is click here on Docs. It's going to open in a new tab, and you're going to read through um, the document. If you get a window like this, just choose the proper account. And then you'll read through all of the information, and so the information will load, and you can read through all of that. Once you're done reading through this information, you're going to want to click the X for this tab, and then you're going to want to go back into Google Classroom automatically. If you think you're going to need this information, then don't click X on the tab, leave it open, and then just click on the previous tab to be able to uh, have both windows open. Once you've read through it though and you understand it, you're gonna click on the title, that's hyperlinked. When you click on the title, you're going to be taken to the assignment page. Now it defaults you to my assignment. It kind of tells you what you can do. Here is where I have given a document it's a template that you're going to use to fill out to answer the questions. Um, but if I can't remember exactly what I'm supposed to do, I can click on Assignment Details, and it takes me back to the assignment. I can click here to pull, pull this back up if I needed it, if I close the window, read the instructions again, and then back on my assignment to come to the instructions. So now that I'm here, I'm going to click on Documents. Um, once I click there, it's going to open, and I'm going to be able to now come in here and edit this document. So. Um, it's, as it loads, I see the instructions, and I see that I need to start here. Um, and so for me, um, I'll come down here, and I'll begin to work on the document, and we'll say blah, 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 right? So we're, we're done. We've completed the document. Now we're going to click on Turn In. You can see there's a Turn In button up here. It takes sometimes takes a little bit to load. Once the whole document's loaded, though, it'll say Turn In. You click Turn In. Once you've clicked Turn In, it'll take you back into uh, the classroom. It'll make sure that you actually want to turn it in. You can actually add a note here. Um, hope I did well. Um, here to uh, send a note to the teacher as you turn it in. You're going to click turn in. And then it will process. And so now you'll see in here that you it is done when you turned it in. If I want to edit it again, I need to click unsubmit. 
and then I can edit again. Um, otherwise, I can click here and just view it. Um, and so now that I'm done, I'm going to click this arrow right here to get back to my classroom. So I'm clicking the arrow, and now I'm back here. And now I see my check mark that I've done docs, and I can now go on to spreadsheets uh, and just follow the same process. Okay, so not all of our, our assignments in this course will, will have a template for you to fill out and turn in. So I'm going to scroll down to one of the assignments that I know doesn't have a template. And so we're going to scroll down here. And um, in this particular case, this is Google Sites. And I read the instructions. And it tells me that in the end, to turn it in, I need to click on the assignment title and then click on the Add button. And from there, add the link to my Google Site. So in this particular one, I'm going to go ahead and click on the title to show you how this works. When you go here and you get to the My Assignment page, there will be no document preloaded for you. So as it loads here, when it comes up, I'm going to be able to show you um, how to do this. So here, the page is loaded now. So now I have no, nothing here to click on. I have to either add or create. If I click on create, I can create a document, a presentation, a spreadsheet, or a drawing to use to turn in. But what I'm going to do in this particular assignment is just add a link. So if I add a link, I'm going to now type in the link, or in your case, probably copy and paste the link to my Google site. In this case, I'll just put my own personal website, which is jamielachlan.com. So as I do that, I'm going to click Add Link. When I add link, I now have the option to turn this in. And I click Turn In. It's going to double check. Is this really what you want to turn in? Yes, it is and I am now done. And so just like the last one, click the arrow here, go back to my classroom, I can go through see the other assignments I haven't done, and here's Google Sites, and now it has a done check mark. So this is how you get through the classroom. I hope you enjoy this. Uh, if you have any questions, email me, Jamie Lachlan at lachlanj at heycisd.net. Enjoy the class.